back guys and welcome to your 28th JavaScript tutorial and in this tutorial we'll be extending the previous part in which I taught you about hosting of variables now this part also will be covering hosting but hosting of functions in the last part we saw that how which appears acceptable to the human eye is actually different in the compiler and interpreter of JavaScript so in this tutorial I'll also give you one such example where you would be confused about what would be the output okay so before starting this tutorial I want to tell you that or basically you should know that if you have done programming in C or C++ or any other language that whenever in a function whenever in a function you use return statement nothing down return executes ever that means if you have function a supposedly we have variable a is or b is 10 and we do return right here and set b equals to 10 20 and call this function and alert just b then you'll see that b remains 10 now this is because in every language almost in every language having functions and like that anything after return statement does not execute that means this statement does not execute okay if we copy the statement above this then yes it will execute itself as you can see the B is not 20 okay so coming to the confusing part which is the hoisting let's see let's create a function who and let's call a undefined function right here bar and let's return this return false and let's create a function bar down here as I told you the code under the return statement does not execute and we do alert hey will I be alerted okay so what's your guesses when I call the function foo when I reload the browser what's your guesses will the alert box be prompted or not if you said it would be prompted then this time you were completely right yes now why this would be prompted I'll tell you in a minute and as we refresh this page and to the surprise of those who said that it won't be prompted because of the return false statement then this is what hosting is all about now as earlier tutorial I'll show you a a alternative code of this tutorial uh, this function which would technically mean same to JavaScript so in function hosting JavaScript what JavaScript does is it takes every function and it moves every function to the top of the scope that means JavaScript thinks that this function foo is right here like this make sense yes it does now because now we are declaring this function foo this function bar at the top of the return statement and then we are calling it so why is this in variable we just get the declaration of the variable move to the top of the block but in functions we get the whole function copied to the top of the block that means if we do like foo here then it would return undefined or maybe some another name foo foo is fine this would be undefined but this would be called up and this is what is about the function hosting and this is the best and the easiest way I could explain it to you and I hope you got this concept clear because this is very important concept in JavaScript and how JavaScript works so if you are not clear as, as well in this tutorial as well then I highly recommend you to watch my previous tutorial as well and this one as well and it would take hardly 10 minutes to you and watch it two times both of the tutorials and doing the math uh, we get that it would take hardly or 20 minutes and I promise you you'll get be you'll be mastered in the hosting of variables and functions in JavaScript 
So don't forget to subscribe and keep watching my videos.